Hey everybody, Nathan from Club Card here. Uh, welcome back to our quick tips video series. Today I'm going to show you how to set up foil uh, for printing. Um, so we're going to go over to our Illustrator document here. Uh, and you can see that I have uh, three artboards created. Um, if you're not sure about how to create artboards and uh, set up a file, make sure to check out our first video, which uh, details how to um, do the initial setup for a print document. Um, but what we're going to do here uh, is I want to have my name um, printed as a silver foil, let's say. Um, so right now it's on the front uh, print artwork. So if I send this to print, um, everything here will be printed in ink. Um, but what we need to do is tell Club Card, hey, I want my name to be as a foil. Um, so what I'm going to do, I like where it is right now on the card. So I'm going to select this text and I'm going to go up here to edit uh, and say cut. Now I'm going to click on my blank artboard. It's important that you click because the next thing we're going to go uh, back up to edit and say paste in place. Now what that'll do is paste it in the exact same spot that it was on this artwork on the, uh, the print artboard here. Uh, in order for this to work, your artboards have to be the same size um, so that Illustrator can paste it in the exact same spot. Um, you can also double check that that was done correctly. If you uh, go back up to edit, you can copy it, click on the first artboard and say paste in place. And you can see it's in the same spot. Um, we are going to want to make sure we delete this text from the print artwork. Um, otherwise you would have the name printed in ink underneath the name printed in foil. And because there's some slight shifting that can occur, you might see those uh, overlapping a bit. So we want to make sure that whatever's printed in foil is only on the foil layer here. Um, also, to ensure that uh, your foil is printed correctly, you're going to want to click on this uh, and make sure up here in the color options that uh, it is set to 100% K only, uh, which is black. Um, make sure that none of the other uh, cyan, magenta, or yellow uh, colors are selected at all. Um, so yeah, 100% black on its own artboard. Uh, once you have that, you can go up and save this document. Um, we're going to save it the same way as we saved it in our uh, previous video. Uh, we're going to use the X1A 2001 preset and under marks and bleeds, uh, select use document bleed settings. Now, if we open that up, you'll see I have a three page PDF file here. So this front page is the uh, what's going to be printed as ink on the front. Page two is what will be printed as foil on the front. And page three is uh, what will be printed as ink on the back. So if you wanted foil on both sides, obviously you would just make a fourth artboard um, in the document and put whatever you wanted to print as foil on that artboard for the back. Uh, and once you have that, that's pretty much it. And that's ready to send off to print. So hopefully that helps. Um, be sure to check out clubcard.ca for all of our products and pricing. Uh, and if you have any questions, you can reach us through the online chat down here in the bottom right. Um, we're going to do a bunch more of these video tutorials. So if you have any special requests, anything you're not sure of, uh, be sure to let us know in the comments and uh, we'll be happy to help you out. Thanks everybody.